What is up guys? I'm Daddy Gamer Fred and welcome back to another Call of Duty Warzone video. In today's video, we're going to be talking about leaks and rumors. So if you don't want to be spoiled, you jump over to this time where we're going to go straight into my gameplay where I slay out with the FAAR and the AUG and get myself my first solo win of season two. And again, it was a crazy one. I didn't expect to win that match. And especially because my brother was hitting me up telling me to basically quit the match so I could jump in the match with him. That <laughs> They were waiting for me in the lobby. And I was like, yo, I'm, I'm in the end game, like relax. <laughs> so you definitely wanna check that out. But let's jump into this Call of Duty 2021 leak, which basically is Call of Duty returning back to World War II. Now, if you don't know, there's three teams working on Call of Duty at all times. So we get one game from each of them pretty much every other year. So we got in the World War II game, and then after that, we got in the Modern Warfare game, which introduced Warzone. And then after that, we got the Black Ops game. And then now, because it's three teams, we're jumping back to the team that's working on the World War II game. The World War II game, when that dropped, it was okay, it was cool. I didn't play a ton of it, but it did commercially well, and it was the back to boots on the ground that everyone was craving after this huge black ops in the future and stuff like that. A lot of people just wanted regular boots on the ground style Call of Duty, and that provided that. So at that time, that did really well for Call of Duty, well enough to them to want to do, I think a direct sequel? We're seeing Call of Duty World War II Vanguard be the title for this year's Call of Duty. It's indicating that Sledgehammer is going back to World War II and it's kind of upsetting because when I think about how Call of Duty is moving forward with Modern Warfare and now Black Ops, I feel like World War II might be a little bit step back considering Warzone. Warzone has been integrating a lot of black ops stuff into the game like, like the weapons and even zombies and i think that needs to happen more as call of duty drops some more games but when you when you tell me they drop in a world War two game i'm like like what kind of good content what kind of good weapons what kind of good variety are we gonna get from that game and i i i don't i don't really know you gotta let me know in the comment section below school your boy i'm not huge on world war ii story games i think i played them a ton in the past and i'm just like dried out on them but let me know in the comment section below do you think jumping back into world war ii having you know basically a ton of world war ii weapons added into warzone you think that would be cool I don't know. I'm not feeling. I wasn't even feeling the vibes on a, a lot of the Vietnam weapons that we got from Black Ops Cold War, and I was just like, eh, 50-50 on them. However, all the Modern Warfare stuff to me, it feels good. It feels right within that game, and just the thought of getting old school style rifles and you know stuff like that that was in World War II. I I don't know. I, I it, to me is not is not meshing well. But let me know what you think about it in the comment section below. If you don't know, I answer all comments. I want to have a discussion with you guys. Let's have that discussion down there in the comments. If you are new, consider hitting that subscribe button. I do videos like this every day. Talking Call of Duty, Fortnite, Mario, Pokemon, Fall Guys. Whatever I feel like dropping the vibes on, I drop it here on the channel. So again, consider hitting that subscribe button. Also, hit the like button. It does help me out a ton as far as moving the video. And to recommend this, other people can check out the videos. Peace. I love you guys. I'm going to see you guys. <laughs> oh, 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 Found him, found him. Oh. 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 <laughs> Leave me alone! Leave me alone! <laughs> Fuck, man! Fuck! 
<laughs> Damn it, man! I'm the neighborhood pusher, call me self woofer. Bitch. That's it. Back at it. Gas is inbound. Marking you safe zone. Enemy soldier incoming. Closing in. Four enemies remain. You know what to do. <laughs> Gas is closing in. Relocate. Incoming, take cover. Good shit. Solo with the meta. Solo win with the meta. Ooh, not so bad. Not so chat. Mm, I feel a little grassy. You can't lie, right? A little... <laughs> Low key changed my mind on the um the off. Hands down. I changed my mind. Not bad. Little eight kills. Not bad.
thank you thank you thank you for making it to the end of this video if you're not a subscriber and you made it this far hit that subscribe button you know you want to join the family ring the bell so you can be notified on the next time i drop one of my videos as well as hit the like button on this video so it could be recommended so more people can check it out so we can have more people join in the family if you want to keep up with me on other social media platforms such as twitter instagram or tiktok or whatever i'm daddy gamer fred on all all of those again daddy gamer fred you'll be able to find all those links in the description of this video and the pin tweet comment on my twitter also on all of my videos i do answer all comments so again if you just want to chat it up about the video or anything just hit me up in the comment section below i take time out of my day and literally answer to all the comments that you guys leave me and i love it and again let's have that conversation down there here are a couple of suggested videos that you guys should check out that may be of your interest i am a variety channel i do tons of stuff tons of pokemon but tons of other stuff as well so dive into these videos peace i love you guys i'm gonna see you guys on the next one